Hey look, we're back, and we're on to 924. Normally I would stream this episode, but I really don't have time today. So, nothing really important happening in the video game industry, so let's talk about something that's happening personally with me in the gaming industry. I got my new Pokemon team ready. With the DLC that's out, uh, I was able to adjust my team a little bit. Uh, so yeah, I while I was adjusting my team and looking up new Pokemon, I decided to add two Asinian po uh, Asinian. H I S U A N, the the Pokemon Arceus game Pokemon, and one of the Pokemon I added was a uh, Hassanian Gudra. Yeah, that thing is now one of my favorite Pokemon. It is the most adorable thing ever, with its little sleeping animation where it goes into its shell. It's so fucking cool. Okay. Oh wait. Oh, I didn't mean to. It forced me into this. Ah, whatever. I can always use more lockpicks. So yeah, I Hassanian Gudra is now my new favorite Pokemon. It used to be Sableye. I'm sorry, buddy, but uh, Hassanian Gudra is so fucking cute. Yeah. Yeah. Is that enough to level up my proficiency? Nah, it's not enough. Either way, nice. let's go put hands on what's its called face. Let's go put hands wow. on uh, Okumura, Haru's dad. Sukunikazu Okumura, the great profiteering sinner of greed. Your success and global fame exists due to the tyranny you reign over your employees. Thus, we have decided to make you confess all your crimes with your own mouth. Hmm. From the Phantom Thieves. I must take care of this before it becomes a problem. I've received a calling card from the Phantom Thieves. I need you to send it over to the police. Don't make me repeat myself. Give it to the police. That's an order. These scoundrels have threatened me. Aren't the police supposed to side with law-abiding citizens? I will not fail. Someone's mad. This matter is urgent. Take care of it at once. I need to let everyone know about this. Hey! Oh, we've never a seat. Why don't we read something until then? Wow, it's been a while since I got a seat in the train. Uh... Eh, musty pages. Hey. That book talks about Jimbocho Book Town, right? You already know about that area, don't you? Seems kind of pointless to read that. All right. Uh, Aquarium a day? Hey. About Ochano Mizu, right? Already know that that place. All right. All right. Uh, let's increase my ability to study. Hmm? Complicated phenomena can always be simplified. Yeah. I see. So it's most efficient to first understand how things are structured. True. True. So you finished reading a uh, factorization guide, a study guide on how to study. This book was very easy to understand. You're going to see that you'll be able to study more efficiently now. All right. Did he say efficiently? With more efficiency. Oh, we're almost at the station. I'd say that was an effective use of our time. Ottomans for eating, autos, but aren't Ottomans for reading. Stores will use whatever reason they can to pull in. Stores will use whatever reasons they can to pull in customers. This season in particular. Ah, oh, yes, people also say Ottomans for sports. A while back, baseball was a national sport, but these days people have been into soccer. As you know, black and white are the common colors for a soccer ball. Now then, Augie son, could you take a look at this picture? Do you know How many one? white and black shapes are there respectively on a soccer ball? No idea. 20 and 12. This is it. I don't play soccer, I wouldn't know. That's correct. This ball is composed of 12 black pentagons and 20 white hexagons. It's made up of, of, of a total of 32 surfaces. By the way, apparently soccer balls used to be the only 
only one color, but I changed it to black and white so it could be better seen on television, or so I hear anyway. Television was still in black and white when they started airing soccer in Europe. At any rate, the contrast of white and black next to each other, it's a slick design, don't you think? I cheated! Oh! Oh. I saw the stars and got excited. A recent design that caught my eye was the moon burger, which uses an egg to represent the moon. If you're well aware of the bad rumors about surrounding Wakumura's foods, but you can't argue with hunger. True. You think someone like her eats hamburgers? Eh, who doesn't? Well, I mean, other than like, uh, Hindus can't eat meat, right? Wait, even figured out when we're gonna do it? This is different from normal. He has some nerve delivering the calling card to the police himself. Either he's certain his heart won't be changed, or he's colluded with the police from the beginning. As strange as it is for me to say, I could see that being the case. Whoa, the comments are coming in hot. Look! Take him down, Phantom Thieves. I don't care what the Phantom Thieves do as long as they show up, haha. -ha. Just do it quick, lol. They're just saying whatever they want. At this point, all they care about is seeing those in power beg for forgiveness. Damn it, this isn't a game! The means and the ends have been reversed. We're starting to be seen purely as entertainment. Mm -hmm. But we gotta do this! We can't just drop everything now! Considering the existence of the palace, his desires are indeed distorted. In a sense, the earlier we pull the root, the better. And given the issue concerning Haru's fiance, we don't have another choice in the matter. If we don't, then everything we've been doing up until now would just be for nothing. I believe this is best too. After hearing my father speak, I saw no remorse in him. Ryuji and Haru were right. Honestly, everything the public is talking about does bother me a little. But Okumura may just be the one behind the mental collapses. We can't leave this be. I want to know the truth. I feel like he's hiding something. Something big. True. And we already sent the calling card after all. Let's do this like we always do. And steal his palace's treasure. Honestly, since I'm not going to get like a fusion alarm today, I might as well go do my daily network fusion. Fuck, that's what I forgot to do. I needed Yusuke to make me a Yusuke. Samra Karm card. I guess I'll do that next time. time for some you wish to perform an actual world beyond this one. Empress. I see. Nah. A strong Hermit. Okay with this? Hermit's only still level one. Not really, then. Chariot. I see. So that's a higher level than me. So let's indeed. check out this one instead. Lovers. Narcissus. Not terrible, but not impressive. Honestly, yeah, I'm fine with that. Select the skills you'd like to inherit. Glutton mouth. It will receive significant Is that it? Power. Yeah, fuck it, I don't care. Girls, let us begin. I'm literally just doing this for the daily fusion. And our sisters, by becoming one with my match, you have gained the visions of true beauty, both inner and outer. Isn't this a guy who like drowned himself looking at his own image in the water? Shame. What's that? Oh, cool. That's pretty good. You change your gun already. But yeah, I need to make Yusuke uh, make a Sam Karm card just so I don't run out. Or did I get the ability that says he can? Give me a second.
to duplicate. He has copied once before. Okay, so yeah, I just gotta remember to do that next time I see him. Um. Dada game. Dada robot. A child. A young man with Greek myth. He, reject, he rejected the nymphed Echo, who faded to a whisper out of despair. Cursed by Nemesis, he fell in love with his own reflection and wasted away. Da, 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 da. Let's get Haru. Yusuke. Yeah. As the power grows, I'm an idiot. There we go. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Rejected today, stealing this treasure. Let's go. I can feel it. Whoa. Hey, what is that thing? Ooh, it's a UFO. Is that the frisbee skull mentioned before? That's what they're making here? The SS Utopia will soon enter its launch sequence from the ship docking bay. After the achievement of the main core, the launch includes some movements. The SSS Utopia? Project Escape to Utopia. So this is what uh, this was about. Father did say he was going to send into the political world. So even his company just stepped up for him. He would have scarred this place for his Utopia. Wait up. If he gets out of here, we're not going to be able to uh, make him talk about the shutdowns. All right, we gotta hurry. I think we can go further in now. Look, that's it. That's the treasure. What? Emergency launch sequence will soon be activated. Certain areas may be shut off or destroyed. I repeat, emergency launch sequence will soon be activated. Go. Less time for talking, more time for moving. This has to be a joke. What did you say? <laughs> <laughs> I'm so tempted. I'm so tempted, guys. You don't even know. You know what? I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm not afraid. Let's go. <laughs> I'm not even scared. <laughs> Will it let me go back? If it lets me go back, I fucking swear, man. See it. Damn it! <laughs> I would have done it. It makes sense that they wouldn't let you go back there, though. They wouldn't want you to be able to soft lock yourself there. Probably best. Let's retreat and come back with a different strategy. No way, we ain't got time for that. We gotta plow right through them. Are you even thinking? If we use up our energy now, we won't, we'll toss away our entire plan. What up, guys? Come down. Joker. Joker, you made the call. I got your back either way. Uh, what's at the top of here then? Hey, I don't think Joker. I've noticed a way to get over there. Hmm? Let's block our path now. All we need to do is get over there. Right. Hey, Joker, you see any grappling hooks on? I can feel it. I do, but I don't want to take the grappling hook parts because that's lame. So I'm gonna bust right through! <laughs> Cause it's cooler. Focus. Show me your true form. 
There's a shadow of him. I'll reveal your true form. Yeah, I know I could, you know, uh, fucking die, but I'm not afraid. There we go. Hey, wait up! We're taking the treasure. There. Well, looks like we caught up to you, Mr. CEO. Hi. I'm sorry. I've had a change of heart. I'll prove it. Father. Haru, you were always so agreeable. Whether it was in school or after, you only ever did as I said. You've become so admirable. What's gotten into him? Ah, uh, yes. Do you remember, Haru? You cried your eyes out when my work kept me from attending your first sports day. It was then that you stopped talking back to me. Honestly, you had me worried. Still, you stood up against me and became an independent young woman. Nothing could make a father happier than seeing that. You still remember something that happened so long ago? Back then, you poured your heart into making delicious food. You wanted to bring joy to others. Why did you change? Forgive me, Haru. You don't believe this bullshit, do you? If my treasure was stolen. Please, don't do it. I'm begging you. Father, let's... Let's end it here. Ah, Haru. You foolish girl. There it is. What? Overcome failure at any cost, even if it means betraying others. That is our family motto. The cold reality of kicking people down is part of business. Virtues and sentiments are for losers. What happiness can be found in acting with justice but losing the battle? Ugh. What happiness can be found through profit, gained by crushing the hearts of others? Better that than fail. I'd much rather destroy others than wallow in the misery of debt. Regardless, I shall soon set sail into the political realm. To the upper echelons of the world. To Utopia. My name shall be etched in the annals of history. Make your decision, Haru. If you cast them away, I'll let you join me on this ship. Stay and you will be incinerated along with this entire base. Now then, what is your choice? You fool. Noir! What about you, boy? Don't you want to get out of here alive? Want to board my ship? You're fighting against the others, are you not? Huh. So you were spying on us. You'll gain nothing by staying with them. That's what you believe, isn't it? You are absolutely right. Sell them out. Cut them off for your own personal gain. I'll even give you the switch once we take off. So, do we have a deal? I'll give you ten seconds. Time is money after all. Take me for such a fool. Everything's gains and losses for you, isn't it? I pity you, Mr. CEO. You lived with Haru for 17 years and you still haven't realized? In this world, there are tons of things that money and fame can't buy. What point would there be in only saving myself? <laughs> Nobody could replace these guys, period. You know what that means? Your offer was a no-go from the start! What? <laughs> Whoa, it hit. Huh. Way to go, me. I like it. So I like the implication of like, oh wait, I didn't expect this to work. I'm just glad it did. <laughs> oh, you stole the show, man. 
<laughs> Father. So much for the negotiation. You rebels. There is time before launch. I will crush you all. Man, I wish. Very well then. Wait. Bring it. You little. You won't get out alive. I wish I recorded my friend doing this boss fight because he failed so fucking hard. It's time you surrender, father. Give up. Try saying that after you've taken down my company's elite soldiers. Do you remember everything's weakness? I don't. Oh, my employees, be the foundation upon which my victory is built. Now, my devoted workers, targeting them at random won't do the trick. You have to take each one out individually. Here, target that one first. The pompous man in the black coat. Isn't it looks vicious? We should go for some of its weakness. Fire! My god, so is an Agi. Go down! Seriously, how useless can you all be? Whatever become of company loyalty? Oh my god. Can you hear my eyes? Yeah, I know what I said. Can you hear my eyes rolling there? Very well then. Haru, teach our employees how to demonstrate their loyalty properly. There she is. Fun fact, this part right here is new. This was added in Royal. Basically, that's my father's cognitive version of me. Oh yes, do you see that timer up there? You have until then to beat it. Just remember, once we take Okumura down, it'll all be over. Let's wrap this up quick. Not happening. You shouldn't have underestimated the strength of my company. Employees! Fall in line. Time to work. Even more. Every problem can be solved with more manpower. That is the strength of my company. Happiness based on the sacrifices of others isn't true happiness. True. It's a vicious foe. Attack with Persona. psychokinetic skills. Some oh, I, other way. oh, I can't. There we go. Hit him where it hurts. You're mine. Guess you already had that. Good. Fun facts. The real difficulty of this boss fight. Any who disagrees with my vision will be struck down as an example. My father's words are absolute. Gross. There's a good dog. Now I can take pride in my work. Accept the peace. So the gimmick that make this boss fight hard is really a case of have you actually leveled everyone and done your social links? Because what happens here is that you had to kill all these guys in effectively the same turn or if you don't kill all if there's even one remaining and an additional turns pass he'll then resummon everyone of the current lineup so yeah let's say that you d did what my friend did and openly ignore some of your confidants and weren't doing all the extra shit he literally did not have the damage possible to kill all of them in one go Persona. as opposed to me Hold who's on. doing this Uh... Okay. Ooh, Joker, you're looking cool. Go, not that Bye. Persona. I lend it. Shit. With 
Beauty and grace. Joker, your defense is the crater. I'm trying to. Oh, he saved my life. Yeah, that would have killed. Hey, what's the hold up? Can't you scrap it? Do one simple job. Enough of this. Target that one next. The obnoxious blonde one. Ow. Go. Are you okay? Keep an eye on your health. I do have. I don't. Oh, wait. There we go. Narcissus! Ravage them! Joker, you're looking cool. Persona. Box, your defense is lower. Persona. Form of persona. Heal yourself. It's not much, but it's better than nothing. I am down. Oh, perfect. Nice. Your time has arrived, Chief Director. Go forth and show them the weight of the corporate elite. Ugh. Time to work. Show some brand loyalty. The vicious foe. Attack with psychokinetic skills. And then there. There we go. It seems ordinary workers are not fit for the job. Executive director, come to me. Time to work. There's the big bad. Now then, fulfill your duty as my right hand man. For the eternal prosperity of Okumura Foods. Support's on the way! Did you raise my defense? Eh, HP's nice too. Persona! How about this? Nothing. Persona! This is my other self. I'm gonna here. buff everyone's ability to dodge. I feel like that's just the best option here. Also. Allow me. Just to play it safe. I won't let some petty thieves stand in the companies. No. In my way. My father's words are absolute. Right on. One must strike the enemy while the iron is hot. Shall we? Accept it. Fuck. The opponent is strong. Don't do anything reckless. Okay. Charge here. Step out of it. Thank you, Ryuji. Much thanks. 
No, here. Ooh, good to know. Something big's coming. Come. That's not right. I believe he's just about to nuke us. Still be dead. Never mind, endure. Yes, I can. Actually, no. Let's go. All right. I'm beat. Using this. I have a bead chain, don't I? Here we go. I'll try this. Thanks. Much obliged. Using this. Ward off the enemy's attack. This is gonna hurt. Only three again. Persona. Eat this. Persona. Prepare yourself. Better. Even by our own employees. Let's end this, Joker. Damn it. If that's how it is. Hung, I command you to go forth. Show them the might of our company. This man would even sacrifice his own goddamn daughter for himself. Yes, father. A cooler of foods will be gutted if I fall. Do you grasp the situation here, Haru? Of course, father. Then protect me, even if it costs you your life. As you wish, Father. This is how my father sees me. Nothing more than a puppet that dances when ordered. I'm getting vibes of what was her name? Rosie from the Jetsons? This is for my father's sake. Persona! How's this? 
your tongue. If you don't stop them, my dreams... <sighs> it seems I've no other choice. Haru, self-destruct. Detonate and take those damn thieves with you. No way. Bakuma was even willing to sacrifice his own daughter? Everyone, let's destroy it before it can self-destruct. But Noir, that's... I am no longer my father's subservient puppet. The real me is standing right here, opposing him. Show some brand loyalty. Here I go. Speed up! Ah, I would have preferred uh, something else, but beggars can't be choosers as the saying goes. Persona. The countdown is already halfway finished. Ravage them! That's what I want to see. Even Haru couldn't stop them. I've had enough. Someone get in here. Anyone. Father, the time's come to end this. I hope you're prepared. It's only fitting that Haru do the last blow. And as you can clearly see, not really strong without his bodyguards in the way. Because, duh. He's just a man sitting in a chair. Bum, bum. Bum, bum. Uh, goodbye, Cybreak. Just Father. I I want to desperately desperately be a fly on the wall. Cuz there's no way. There's just no fucking way that all of these companies, every single last one of these major companies can't afford to pay their employees more. There just can't be. Like Then you see these companies, like, owners buying yachts and entire fucking islands and shit. But I guess you can't get that high without being cutthroat and greedy. But really, is it just that hard for any of them to just pay their goddamn employees and not work them to a point of fucking collapsing? There has to be one, right? behind all the breakdowns and mental shutdowns, weren't you? I admit I spent large sums of money to help my company grow and to crush business competitors. Answer me, damn it! Did you do it or not? Not personally. I have a contract. All I did was make the requests to have them eliminated. Requests? Then there really is a mysterious criminal in people's palaces after all. So it's true. What kind of contract did you form? And with whom? <laughs> Come on, stop crying and tell us! Warning! Damn it, why now? Mr. CEO, can't you stop that thing? Oh well. We can't just throw our lives away like this. Look, up there! We've taken your treasure. Huh? There's one more thing you need to tell us. Have you seen this criminal's face before? Warning. We don't got time image. to get that out of him. We'll just have to inquire about it back in the real world. Panther! Shouldn't we bring Father with us? Don't worry, he'll be fine. We'll end up dead if we're not out of here soon, though. Only you can follow through on your own responsibilities. That is what you've taught me, Father.
Bang. Will we make it? Probably not. Actually, I think it's impossible. We're counting on you, Mona. <laughs> uh. Four, three, two, one. Goodbye. Uh, my heart is still pounding. We did a great job in there. You know, Morgana, you seemed almost normal when you took the treasure. Oh? The truth behind the mental shutdowns remains unsolved, though. Okumura wasn't the culprit. Still, he did mention requesting people to be eliminated. He has to know who's responsible. Hmm. Mom. Is this... His treasure was a plastic model kit? What's the matter? I remember father telling me something before he changed. He said there was a model kit he really wanted back when he was a child. But no matter how much he begged my grandfather, he never got it. Your family could get like a thousand of those kits though. Okumura Foods has been around for generations, but it was a small company until my father took over. My grandfather was a good man but not the best businessman. He'd even lend money with no collateral. It seems the debt collectors were a frequent presence when my father was young. Well, that must be why. Why Okumura was so willing to pursue his own happiness at the expense of others. Whoa! This thing's insane! It is a staggering price. I've heard this can happen to collector's items, but still... People are gonna pay that much for a plastic toy? Yes. By the way, when exactly is the change of heart supposed to happen? Soon. That's all we know. We'll just have to wait and see what happens until then. Once he has his change of heart, we'll surely be able to find out who's behind the mental shutdowns. And there we go. <laughs> yes. Exactly as you planned, sir. Everything. From the phantom thieves targeting Okumura, to them changing his heart. We've lost a convenient source of income, but I'd rather not risk his connection coming to light. Okumura was not fit for the political world to begin with. He should have just behaved himself. Of course, without fail, sir. I've requested that he handle the matter. Arrangements have been made. A sudden mental shutdown will occur at just the right time. We'll dispose of our disappointing connection and the Phantom Thieves at once. Two birds with one stone. <laughs> and again, I say, gross. I've actually been thinking a bit about my actions this time. I was way too worried about who I am and how I don't compare to the other members of our group. Turns out I just don't have any guts, huh? That happens to everyone. Even though I'd still think you're a little bit of a hypocrite. Thanks. I think the reason I was so hung up on wanting to be human is because I needed a goal of my own. Well, not a goal per se, but something bigger. I guess more like a reason to live. But now that I'm sure I belong with the Phantom Thieves, I know what I want to do. Do you know what it is? Make us more famous? What else, right? I'm going to do whatever I can to make sure the Phantom Thieves succeed. In other words, our goals are in alignment. From now on, I'm not going to hold anything back. You'd better put some effort in too. Don't make me regret my choice. I feel my bronze Morgana is growing deeper. 
chance to shield Joker from an otherwise fatal attack. Right. By the way, thank you, Ryuji. Plus, I want Lady On to be happy. If my actions can help her achieve happiness, that's more than enough for me. I wonder what the mascot character for Persona 6 is going to be. Not thinking about how sappy all of this is. Persona 3, we had the doll. Persona 4, we had the bear. Persona 5, we're getting the cat. Persona 5X, we have an owl. Still not playing that gotcha game bullshit. Persona, what animal? Hmm. Maybe a fox in Persona 6? Then again, we technically had a fox in Persona 4 as well. A bunny in Persona 6. Yeah, we'll see when it eventually comes out. And there we go. Whoa. Success. Now let's left is to wait for the Kuma's change of heart. Thank you for so much today, everyone. Likewise. You must surely be exhausted. It's just you go to sleep early. Hey, we should talk about Haru's welcome party. Didn't we say we would let her rest, you dimwit? Appreciate your concern, but I'm okay, I promise. As long as you're okay, Haru. Well, there's anywhere you'd like to go. Actually, I'd like to walk around the school festival with everyone. You mean the Shuja school festival? I must admit, I'm interested as well. Then it's settled. That reminds me. We still haven't settled on a guest. A guest? Like, some kind of celebrity? Wait, does that mean the fan thieves could be one of the candidates? How about it? Want to show up? That's a bit over the top. You're getting way too carried away. Don't say such strange things. What a shallow idea. Ooh, a four-hit combo. Sorry. <laughs> Bullied. All right, obviously I can't go out. So with that, I think it's a pretty good place to stop. When we return, we will go back to living the normal life of a Japanese high schooler. <laughs> out of the way, I want everyone out there to have a good morning, evening, day, or night, wherever you're at. But for right now, I am out. Later.